What is up, guys? Um, after that weird beginning, um, we have a little uh, showcase for all y'all people out there. Um, anyways, what this is, it's a, not a showcase of a single mod, it's a showcase of how a bunch of mods work. Uh, I'm just gonna put you right off the bat. If you don't have a good computer, if you're working on a laptop, there are some shader packs out there or mods that you can use, but this is mostly for the higher end computers. Um, yeah. Well, first of all, we're going to start off, you have your standard TMI, too many items, download. You have in the top right, you have Ray's minimap up there. Um, and now we get to the interesting stuff. First, as you can see, this is not the normal Minecraft. Minecraft doesn't look this sexy. As in, the water doesn't look this nice in Minecraft. What is this? Like, honestly, look at that water, look at that reflection. Anyways, um... And also, like, the sh sh shadows and all that. Of course, it's a shaders pack, and you can see that even my shadow is different. Whoa, what's that? I'll tell you, get to that in a minute. But, to start off with it, um, we have the Zeus, I think it's called. Zeus version 10.0 Ultra de Depth of Field Shader Pack. Um, this is where you're going to need Minecraft Forge to do anything with this. Um... So Minecraft Forge allows you to do all this beautiful stuff. Uh, it, it makes installing mods a bunch easier. That's all I'm going to say. Because every single mod I've installed so far is going flawlessly. And that's nice. So, um, what you do, you need Minecraft Forge. And then you're going to have to download a bunch of other things. Um, I'll put a link in the description of a video that kind of explains how to what you need as the basics. Also, if you notice that it has the motion blur, if you're in front of this... If you're looking at this, it'll put this stuff in focus rather than that stuff. I think this might be a bug because that means that you're... Well, no, because you're looking in the middle because your hand is always out of focus, which I don't mind it because it makes you feel more into the game, but some people might not like that. Anyways, moving on, um, we now have the Better Animations mod. This is the thing I started off with, and I probably won't be going over every single one of them, but as you can see, I have actual joints. Yep. I have um, joints, and this is what I like about it. When you fly around in creative mode, you kind of just like hop, which looks really cool. And then that's the, also the following animation. That's the jumping animation, which, which some people um, think it looks strange, but I actually think it looks pretty cool. Because, I mean, what are you gonna do? Then it, you can tell that this is the normal jumping. If you sprint, the sprinting looks just friggin' amazing. That's what I want to say for once. Uh, so yeah, let's just get to there. Look at that. Looks amazing it's perfect sprinting animation and then you can jump and do an epic leap and then and then yeah you can stand underwater and make it look really cool with the shaders pack um but now we get to see the swimming animation um which is really nice it's yeah you don't have that awkward hopping in and out of water you can do the butterfly <laughs> michael phelps right up in here um so anyways i'm just gonna keep swimming and swimming and as you can see, wow, that looks nice. And there's a pig. Look, it's a pig coming out of the water. Oh. Um, anyways. Uh, yeah, it's a bit strange that I'm a bit naked un in this inside of my feet. But that's just, the, that's just the skin itself. I can go and edit that. But I don't see the reason why. So I'm just going to hop out. Um, I don't know. There's some I'm actually going to go in and get myself some sword. Because there's some other animation for swords, too. Okay, so blocking animation makes you go like this. So you're really all like ready and then you're like hua, hua, hua. I don't I think there might be a slight difference to hitting animation, but not much. So you can be like And yeah, you can make yourself look all cool like that. Um I think the sprinting animation is pretty the key to this. If you're ever on multiplayer, this looks amazing. Like honestly. And you have a bunch of people running around. It's just like, whoa. If you ever have a war, a Minecraft war, looks really nice. Um, so yeah, and then there's the shifting animation, which makes you look like you're Usain Bolt and you're about to sprint away. Or you can be on your tippy toes and be like, I'm a, or you can just stop in the middle of it and be like, I'm breaking gravity. But if you just go tippy toe, tippy toe, you can also sneak, of course, with it. This just makes it look kind of weird. Because then you're 
pretty much not moving. Anyway, so you can sneak along. It actually makes it look, rather than the normal shift, which makes you look like you're moving really, really slow, this one makes you look like you're moving methodically. And then you get the sprinting animation. Clicking, and you can, you can do whatever. So yeah, that's pretty much all the mods I have installed now. Of course I have Ray's minimap installed, that's a pretty standard one. If you haven't heard that, then uh, you're new to Minecraft. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I can, I'm just gonna fly away here in my awesome style. Um, and like, favorite, subscribe, and I know this is our first video actually for GameSide, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was my first time doing mods and all that. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I, uh, yeah, that's it. Okay, anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching. Uh, leave a comment if you got any questions about installing. I'll put a description to install the shaders. The other ones I just recommend looking up on YouTube um, because it took me a couple of videos to figure it out very well. <laughs>